Grandma Holine's coming up today for your performance. And Grandma Holine. What about Grandma Griffiths? I thought we were going to say a prank. Where can we come? <laughs> okay, we're going over right. the uh, schedule so the kids are aware of what's going on. So I am leaving. Prayer. I think it really wants to say a prayer. Uh, um, I'm going to New York for the next couple of days. The kids are going to be home. And I wrote everything down on the calendar. Tonight you guys have a choir performance that I'm so sad I'm missing. But Grandma and Grandpa Holine are so amazing. Yep, Dad's going to record, so I'll make this short. <laughs> Grandma and Grandpa Holine are coming up to it. On Friday night, the last day that I'm gone, you guys are going to sleep over at Grandma and Grandpa Griffiths. Mm -hmm. because Saturday morning you'll all be there. Dad's gonna come get me late from the airport and then we're gonna hang out for Grandpa's birthday. I wish we could go skiing too. Well, we're supposed to get snow starting today, so. Probably so. not though. I wish we could make a huge oh, we'll skiing drive us to some cabin. I wish we could build a huge oh, chill that's huger than our house. Huh? Since Bonnie's out of town, I figure I am going to do a little um, venturing on my own. I'm, I feel like I'm cheating on Bonnie right now because I'm doing something that she always does for me. You know, I'm just one of those things that I've just never had anybody else for. And um, I feel like I'm overstepping some boundaries right now. I am going to a salon and spa and getting my hair cut. Don't tell my wife I'm cheating on her. Um, I think I like it. I honestly... I don't know if that's quite what Bonnie was going for. I don't know, this is weird. Bonnie left out of town this morning and I didn't have a ton of direction from her on my hair. And this is what he did. And I really want to know what he thinks or what she, I really want to know what she thinks about it. I think she's going to like it. He did a nice job. I feel like made my beard stand out. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, but we have a performance tonight with the kids that I want to be ready and nice and sharp looking for. So this is it. No, I don't think you'll need to tuck this in. We're going to put a sweater over top of it. And I think you guys will look sharp. You have to be kind of sharp dressed for your program. Okay. Do you do? Okay, let's see. Five and six. And five and six. They're both five and six. Okay, put that one on over top. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, spend my time. Olivia's on hair doing duty since mom is gone because she's better at it. Then I am. I am now on dog food duty. Because that's the job you get demoted to when you're not the best at doing hair. But speaking of hair, this haircut looks, looks pretty good. Go of everything but you. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and That is a sharp looking hairdo, bud. Your hair was sharp, but then you itched it and destroyed it. Uh, Olivia's gonna fix it. Thanks, Olivia. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy looks. Oh yeah, we gotta scrub some stuff off your thing. Yeah. Don't pick at it because that will um, pull the threads. I'll just get it with some water, okay? That's probably left over Thanksgiving. No, he's. We're just gotten ready for um, the program tonight. You're actually on speakerphone. Hi, Mama. With the kids. Hi, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hi, guys. Hi, Mommy. Hi, Mama. Who would you guess? Cooper. Sounded kind of dumb. That's Lincoln. Hi, Mommy. <laughs> you should Cooper. see everybody. They look so sharp. Olivia did everybody's hair and they look amazing. My name is Cooper. Are you guys on your way out to your play? Yeah. Yes. As soon as, as, soon as Grandma and Grandpa get here. Awesome. I love you. missing you guys on the plane. Were you able to enjoy your flight at all or no? You didn't have to work on it? Good, good. That's what I hope for, so. Have a good day. No 10 people didn't just get out of a six passenger car. It doesn't matter. We're in Logan, it just doesn't matter. Grandma and Grandpa Holine came up and we're missing somebody. There's Uncle Jared. Uncle Jared is in town.
put on her Sweetly singing all the plains And the mountains in reply Echoing their joyous dreams Gloria In excelsis Deo gonna join us for this bud guess what that was your last year that was your first year of going to a Christmas performance with the kids but next year you're gonna be in it does that sound fun okay you go to bed do you know that daddy loves you and do you know that mommy said to tell you she loves you while she's away hey don't tug on the string you know mommy loves you do you love mommy what would you tell mommy right now if she was here what would you say? You could say you'd love her. Does that mean you love her? Okay. Good night, bud. That's a little nerve wracking to see all those cords hanging down from Cody's lights. But I guess you're okay. Boston, you did such a good job on your performance today. Do you know that? Mm-hmm. And mom wanted me to tell you that she loves you. She wanted you to know before you go to bed that she loves you. What would you tell mom if she was here? Mm -hmm. What would you say, Mom? Mm -hmm. You wouldn't tell her you love her? I love her. You do love her? I know you do. Okay. Good night, bud. I sleep with her. Nope. Mm -hmm. Good night, bud. Hold on to her though for a minute. You doing some last minute homework? Yeah. Okay. I just finished. Good job. Okay. Can you sign it real fast? I'll sign it in a minute. I'm proud of you tonight. You did a good job. Did you enjoy doing it? Mm -hmm. Singing and dancing? Get you in the Christmas spirit? I just definitely got kicked right here. That's okay. Um, Mom wanted me to tell you that she loves you and was thinking about you when she went to bed tonight, okay? Mm -hmm. What would you tell Mom if she was here? I would love her. You love her? Okay. Mm -hmm. Turn that little light fire hazard off and go to bed. Okay. Good night, bud. Mm -hmm. Come on, lady. Come on, babies. Help her down. You help her down? These are just such big heights for you because you're just a little babies. Let's go say goodnight to Sissy. Hey. Um, no, I don't know what's going on in here. That's fine if you sleep in your little tent. And, oh, sweetheart. Okay, she can climb into her kennel and sleep with you tonight. But you got to go to bed too, okay? I gave you some medicine for tonight so that your throat will feel better, okay? And it's going to make you sleepy, so you need to go in and go to bed. So climb up in your bed. Put her up in bed. Okay. I'll take her collar off in just a second. Olivia. Yes? Mom wanted to, you to know that she's very proud of you for tonight and that she loves you and is thinking about you while she goes to bed, okay? Okay. What would you tell Mom if she was here? Good night. Good night? You wouldn't say anything else? Like, I love you? Or... <laughs> I love you. And... Thank you for being my mom. Aw, and I miss you. Okay, well, with that, we are going to close the vlog here. If you liked the kids' performances and thought they did a great job as much as I did, give the video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. There's plenty more of those performances and Christmas fun to be had. So stick around. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys. Oh, oh. Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep